Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading down uh, 618. NASDAQ is, <clears throat> excuse me, off uh, 324. s and is off 85. Gold. Gold contract up $25, trading at 1877 an ounce. We have silver up 16 cents, $21.98 an ounce. Platinum up uh, down a buck and a half, 974 an ounce. Light sweet crude down 99 cents, $120.82 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10 year note down a full point, plus three ticks at 116.26. The 30 year bond trading down one full point, plus 11 ticks. <clears throat> Excuse me, folks, at uh, 135.22. Now, the 10-year, folks, okay, bottom line, just hit all-time highs, yielding. We're yielding 3.156 right now. That's uh, bottom line. <laughs> that's all-time highs for a, a long period of time here. And King Dollar, the thing that's amazing, King Dollar is up 911 ticks. You're trading out at 104, 134, and gold took off like a rocket ship, okay? Now, let's get over to the S&P and take a look at it, because what you have out here is this. You're going after... Yeah, low. Sw you swing low, but you're going after this with light volume. Uh, bottom line is that you have 85 million. Your high volume swing low is 380. We did 131 million there. Now the top, the high of the high volume swing low is 397.03. So this could get really cool coming into the close here, because if you can get up to three. 97.63, that's going to be a rejection of lower price with lighter volume. And what that's going to do is that it went to the high, rejected it, and what that would set up is that it's going to set up, guess what? Can't bust them down. It's going to try to do another retracement. That's the bull side. The bear side of this would be Let's go look at the futures, and I'll go through this as soon as the program starts for sure. If we go take a look at the futures, what you're going to see is that you're taking the, you, you've hit the low. When it hit a low, you had the volume contracting. It's been contracting all morning once we hit the low. It, it didn't do an ABC structure down. The last time that we had, see, the last time we had any big volume on the way down in the futures was this price point of 39.30. And we're at 39.28. If we're in that workshop, I was showing people in that workshop, that's where you should get a bounce. Now that bounce there is also 0.382. So if we die in the vine right here at 38.30, that's saying, guess what, man? All that was doing is building cars for lower price. So this is gonna be a cool hour shaking it out, you know, as to where this market wants to go. Stay right there, folks, come right back. Sharpening your